All right, today we're gonna to give you a display of an unusual foundry flask. This is an Atom slip flask. It's uh, different than any flask you've probably seen and you probably won't see another one. You'll notice in the interior, there's nothing to hold the uh, sand in. No groove, no holes, no circular, nothing. Particularly, there's nothing at all in the drag section. The reason why is the sand's held in the cope by this retracting metal ring. When you pull this lever, it's got a mate on the other side, it pulls that ring back. So how you use this is you'd invert the drag, you'd ram up, put a bottom board here, you gotta hold the bottom board and flip it over. Coat goes on over your pattern. Got to make sure these two levers are in because that's what's going to hold the sand when you separate it. All right. When you're done ramming and you want to leave the sand, you open these up. You'd normally have to hammer on this. That's why they're not popular because it beats them up. Hammer a little bit. Lift up, take the whole flask off, leaving the sand. It's completely different. Not a great design. You have to use it a little different than other flasks. It's really important that you get the bottom board underneath it or your drag will fall out. So it's not good for doing a double roll unless you're really careful. And in a flask this size, a double roll is manly. I actually got this just for the Adams uh, V-pins. This is probably the best pin assembly you can get and it's bolted in so you can take it off and move it to other flasks. Thank you. Have a good one.